People in one main town may have heard the sounds of some bluegrass bands playing in the distance today. That's because the East Benton Fiddlers Festival was back for a milestone anniversary. New Center Maine Sam Olson tells us why it's such a special event. This is pretty sentimental to me. It's like priceless. Each year has been a priceless year. Chuck Littlefield hasn't missed a festival since its beginning in 1972. The East Benton Fiddlers Festival has been a staple of the Littlefield family farm ever since. And in its 50th year, people are remembering the woman who started it all. It surely was at the heart of all of this and uh, her, her loss is still felt and uh, her presence is definitely still here. Here at the farm, Shirley Littlefield started welcoming people for a day of fiddling and fun, quickly turning those people into family. At just three years old, Tim Lawrence came to the first festival with his parents. After all these years, he says the festival reminds him of where he comes from. This is part of my upbringing and part of what uh, really has made me who I am. It's just been a huge part of my life and it all started here for me. The festival showcasing anyone who's willing to take the stage. Even seasoned musicians showing the younger generations how it's done. Doug Protzik is someone who's been part of the festival since its start. It's kind of an iconic uh, experience for me over the many, many years. Years of fiddling that may not have progressed without Shirley's support. Support that has led some of these bluegrass musicians to teach, passing along Maine's traditional music. It just keeps blossoming out more and more and, and it's kind of a, a musical family. A musical family that keeps showing up year after year. We just want to keep this, this legacy of my mother's going. A legacy of bluegrass music that was sure to be heard across East Benton. In Benton, Sam Olson, New Center, Maine. The festival started with less than 100 people in attendance back 50 years ago, and that number has grown tremendously throughout the past few decades.